Hey, this is Michael from Sarah.biz in Annapolis, Maryland, and today we're going to learn how to set up Google Analytics with your freezing form on a Joomla 3 website. So log into your Joomla backend, go to Components, Freezing Forms, Manage Forms, then uh, select a form that you want to use. In this case, it's uh, this one. Click it. And uh, over to the right, go to Advanced, and then click More Options. Once that screen opens, scroll down to End Submit, and uh, be sure to click Custom, and then add this code. You can get this code over at sarah.biz. Just follow the link in the description down there. Then be sure to Save. If you don't save, it won't save. Now. Um, Let's go over to Google Analytics and uh, log into the admin section. Be sure you're in the right account, right property, and then go to View and Goals right there. Just click Goals. And now click New Goal. And you'll be taken to a process. And it's pretty simple. Just fill it out. Choose template. In our case, we're going to use a sign up because we're using the form as a sign up form. And when you click that, you got to scroll down a little. Save. Um, continue, rather. And as you continue, give it a name and choose destination. This is important. That's what you want. It's a destination. Click continue. Make sure you're set as equals to. And then type in your thank you page. Uh, don't put the full URL. Just do slash and then the uh, name of the page. Um, you should set case sensitive because it's Joomla PHP. Uh, typically running on Apache server, case sensitive. You can change values and funnel if you want. And there you go. Your new uh, tracking code is set up. Uh, test your form and in 24 hours go back to Google Analytics. Go to conversions and you should see your conversions. So there you are. If you have any questions, uh, feel free to you know visit, ask a question, um, give us a call. We have it out.